All right, y'all, tonight we're going to be making some chicken and gravy, chicken and Cajun gravy. First things first, I'm going to take these uh, chicken breasts and I'm going to cut them in half. All right, I got my butter and my oil. It has melted. My oil is ready. I cut these in half. Some of these are thinner. I'm going to cook the thicker pieces first. All right, now for our dredging pans, we got one cup of buttermilk. We're going to add one egg to that. I'm going to add a little bit of hot sauce. About like that. Use your hot sauce of choice. Take a fork, stir it up real well. Once you mix it up, put it in your dredging pan. In our other dredging pan, we're gonna add some flour. We're gonna add some garlic powder to the flour. Then we're gonna add some Tony's, cause y'all already know, why not? And it's gonna be plenty. About like that. Take a different fork that's dry, mix it up. Now, of course, you ain't got to use Tony's. That's just fine. I know some of y'all can't even find it. Uh, just whatever seasoning you want. Now, I'm going to take my mallet, and I am going to thin out these chicken breasts. All right, once we tenderize these and got them thinned out, I am going to cut it in half and put these into two different pieces. You ain't got to do that. That's fine. Take our piece of chicken. We're going to put it in the flour. Make a dance. Then we're going to put it over here in our egg wash. Again, make a dance. Go back into the flour. Again, make a dance. Put it in your frying pan. All right, as our chicken cooks, we'll go ahead and start on this gravy. In a small saucepan, I'm going in with two tablespoons of butter or margarine. Also, with this uh, chicken that I'm frying, I'm flipping it. Considering I tenderized it, about every four minutes. So four minutes each side. All right, now we're gonna add half a tablespoon of townies, two tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Now that butter's melted, go ahead and add that. My other tablespoon of flour. All right, I just take a fork. We're gonna get this to brown in. It takes about three minutes. All right, now for our gravy, we're gonna add one cup of milk. I just do this number with a fork. Get all them clumps out. All right, y'all, so I just did this number and let it thickened up, and now it's ready. We got our fried chicken. My husband keeps coming in here and eating it. So pretty much country fried chicken and gravy, some Cajun gravy. We're going to have some mashed taters and some corn with this. I got to hurry up and get my husband's thing ready. He got to go to work. If you try, let me know. And remember, I love y'all. There it is, y'all. So good.